All right. Hey, everybody. I am here interviewing my client, Mona, who just graduated the FitSet program. I'm super excited to interview her just because her goals were a little different. She came to me wanting to um, gain some healthy weight. And so I just wanted to introduce her. Welcome. Welcome, Mona. Hi, guys. I'm Mona. All right. And so you just graduated like what, two weeks ago? Three weeks ago? It's been flying by. I know. Two, two weeks ago, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it really does fly by. <laughs> right? I know everybody was, was always like 12 weeks. It seems like such a long commitment. And then it goes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's really insane. That's exactly how I feel. I feel like I started and we did our onboarding and I got the swing of things. And then it was like, all right, graduating. And I was like, how did this happen already? <laughs> <laughs> I know it flies. It does fly by. <laughs> Perfect. Well, uh, I just wanted to ask you a couple of questions about your experience, um, especially since you had different experience. A lot of my girls in the program want to lose body fat and lose weight um, for you. And I've also been on this end of the spectrum where you want to gain healthy weight, gain lean muscle mass, all that good stuff. So can you kind of walk us through like, why, why did you join FitSet? Why did you choose to hire a coach and kind of choose this experience for yourself? Yeah. So um, I've always been in group um group class, like group, like boxing and CrossFit. And so when COVID hit, um, you know, I tried to do the whole online program stuff and I was doing your workouts and that's how I found you. Oh. And I was like, Oh my gosh, I love these workouts. Um, and you, one day you posted about being a coach and having signups and stuff. So I looked into it and I was like, this is exactly what I need because we have the group zooms. Um, you record them even if you can't come and there's the slack there's the there's just amazing woman and like uplifting community um that you can use as an amazing resource and you have your website and you have your app and you have your group reviews and it was just everything that i needed with covid nothing being open and i really wanted to keep my weight up and i really wanted to have, reach certain goals um so it was just like perfect. Awesome. <laughs> so I signed right up. <laughs> and I'm so I glad know. I did. You were, you were ready. And that's the thing. I get a lot of students that like, uh, you're a student, you're working, right? Like you have all these things going on and I really target busy women, but you were like, I'm ready. I'm ready to get going. <laughs> I was like, okay, girl, let's do this. <laughs> um, what were, what were some of your biggest goals with doing fit set? So your goal wasn't necessarily to lose weight, right? Like you, what were, what were your specific goals that you wanted to achieve during COVID? Cause that was like a crazy year. So what were some things you were Yeah. So I am one of the weird ones and I lost weight during COVID. <laughs> so I really just wanted to gain some weight back and, um, just become, feel stronger. Um, like I said, I used to be in a lot of like group workout classes and I just missed that feeling and I just like, mental health and physical like I just wanted to be healthy again um and it's crazy just just following along with the program how much better you feel um and I I, I do feel like I, I achieved all of that um feeling healthy feeling better about myself and the thing about fit set that I really loved is like you really focus on mind mindset as well um which I think is a huge thing with COVID um, you don't focus on just the physical aspect and being healthy in that sense, but from like the inside out. Um, so that was really, oh, that was a plus too. I didn't see that, co that coming, but it was, it was, it was a really good experience just kind of hitting everything. Um, so, so that was probably my favorite part and, and, and reaching those goals as well. That's awesome. I know, and for your job, you have a physical job, right? Like you're a PTA, right? And yeah, you, you need exactly. to like help lift patients up. You're exactly right. Like you need, you need like that my patients too, but also myself. So it was like a double whammy. Ah, yeah. So I was going to say like increasing strength for sure. And you did the home program, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, perfect. Did, were the workouts like, did you like having structure in the app and the workouts and everything? Okay kicked my butt oh my gosh and it was really interesting too because when I first started obviously I was like a little deconditioned and I was like puffing and puffing and then to the end of it I was like having to buy heavier weights like yes. it, like I went from like struggling with these like six or eight pounders that I had dumbbell set and I was like oh my gosh I cannot finish this workout and then to the end just like okay uh I need 20s I need 25 what? and yeah and doing it with 20s and 25s like 
I'm telling you, I just feel Dang. Like, so it was, it was oh, like, I would have never expected that from a home workout too. Cause like I said, I've always been doing like yeah. weightlifting and in the gym and stuff, but that's, awesome. <laughs> that's, so good. that's so good that you pushed yourself. Like that's, I always love hearing when people like have to get heavier weights. Cause they're like, yeah, this is getting easy. And especially for you, like you're a tiny human. So the fact that you're doing like twenties and 25s and most women are scared of lifting. And for you, like your, your muscle development. <laughs> you want that right like you want that like lean muscle you look so good um so you enjoyed like the app and just like the workouts and everything with and the group calls like were you I know you weren't able to be on it because you were busy with school and work but were you able to watch the playbacks whatever yeah, watch the playbacks um over the weekends and they're only like an hour and I just you cover so much in them and it's it's really great to hear um you know everyone else's story and what what they're going through and what's working for them and what they're struggling with. And you're like, yeah, I'm going to try that out. You know, like I could go to bed early too. And it makes such a big difference. Just little things like that. Um, just like reiterating and, and um, hearing everybody else, um, their stories and stuff. So it's, I love that part too. Yeah. The community feel I love, uh, yeah. The collaboration of everybody. Right. Cause sometimes it's like right in front of you, like what you need to do and somebody else will say it. And then you're like, Duh, why, why am I not doing that? Why did I not think of that? Yeah, it's a good self-reflection moment too. Yeah, that's, I'm proud of you for watching the playbacks. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and then what was like the most surprising thing you learned? So you are like in the health like field, right? And like medical field. And, you know, we covered a lot of things and you said you kind of learned some stuff. So what was like the most surprising thing that you learned throughout FitSec? Um, that's, that is the crazy thing is like, I am an exercise science major and and just the nutrition part, like we maybe had one class on it and just learning how to weigh my food correctly and use the food scale and um, my macros and like listening to all of that. And I know we kind of talked about this earlier, but um, through that out with my, my specific food or preferences, I was able to find my staple and go-to snacks that I like that are plant-based or dairy-free um and so that whole learning curve of it the nutrition part was really fun and um you know it was kind of like trial and error in the beginning but then getting that feedback from like the food reviews and like seeing okay like this is working I'm gonna keep up with this and now it's like oh god it's really working I'm like up seven pounds how did that even happen um so that part was probably my favorite and I I really enjoyed that part and I feel like I'm going to keep that going and it's, it's going to be like a lifelong, um, like lesson that I get to take with me even after graduation and stuff. So, um, yeah, yeah I really love that part. <laughs> That's awesome. So it's, you've learned like things that you can keep for your lifestyle, right? It's like sustainable things that you can actually do. It wasn't, I didn't surprise you with like, we're doing the like keto or we're, we're going to take some diet pills. <laughs> No, that was the crazy thing is like nothing was a diet. I mean, obviously I was in surplus. So, but even then, like nothing was restricting, nothing was like super crazy. Um, that was probably my favorite part of it is like, if anything, I gained stuff that I can add to my diet. Like you said, lifelong process, um, yeah. sustainable and all of that. So it was pretty amazing. And I know from the other girls too, who had other goals, um, even they were saying that it wasn't restrictive for them. And I remember, I think it was the Super Bowl. Oh, yeah. Like, look, I'm going to have what I want to eat and, you know, come back tomorrow and not get too down on myself. And it's a new day. And I just, as an exercise, exercise science major, I just thought that was so amazing. Um, That's incredible. Yeah, because you'll be able to use all the tools, hopefully with your patients and like, whatever path you go down right like you'll be able to influence people and help teach them these things and that's like the ultimate goal fit set is like all these things that are sustainable all these things that we should just be taught I don't know why we're not taught these things in college or high school like right so you'll be able to impact so many people and hopefully be that healthy example for your family and, and you said like your your kids in your class were like starting to do the stuff like some of the snacks you were eating <laughs> yeah they're like, oh my God, that's so good. I want that. And they would show up with it the next day. And I'm like, isn't it great? They're like, yeah. Yes. Influencing the world. That's cool. It's just like being a healthy example. Like, again, no restricting. It's not a diet. It's, it doesn't have to be miserable. And 
I know with like, I've also like tried to do a lean bulk, right? Like a cleaner and you, you did really well with that. Some people would take that and be like, oh, I have 2000 calories I need to eat. Let's just eat pizza and garbage. And you did really well with like nutrient dense foods, you know, and like healthy snacks and plant-based protein. So I was super proud to see all the things you implemented. And yeah, we, we had some fun sometimes, right? <laughs> Normal. <laughs> like, like, but, yeah. Do you, did you do well with like moving forward the next day? Like you just kind of like, we're like, it's good. I, I didn't mess up my progress. We're good to go. Yeah. Yeah. And that was a lot for me is like, having to give myself that grace to be like, okay, I didn't meet that, you know, calorie goal, but tomorrow or today I'm going to try again. And like Mm -hmm. I would. And so it was just that process of just not getting too down on yourself. And I feel like you like really focused on that. Just like, you know, things happen, life happens, get back on the horse and like, go, (laughs) go get it and move on. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It happens to all of us. And that's the thing that that was like my biggest learning experience when I was going through the journey of like gaining weight and losing weight and all the stuff. It was like, what actually will help you moving forward, right? Like giving yourself grace. We're not going to ever be perfect. So I'm super glad that like, that's been implemented and and kind of ingrained in your brain right (laughs) you're busy you're so busy (laughs) um do you have any advice for somebody who is contemplating joining fit set and like they're busy they're a student or they they just kind of are on the fence about joining fit set what would you say to them um i would say one do it (laughs) uh no um i think what you put in is what you get out there there are so many resources with your program, you know, like I said, like the app, your website and the group calls and um, the food reviews and just, there's a lot, but like, if you do every single thing, you will, you will see the results. Like there, without a fail, it just works. I feel like you guys just have it to a science and it's just amazing. Um, so yeah, what you put in is what you get out and, and if you have, if you're struggling or anything, um, just reach out to the to the ladies. They're so amazing. Um, it's such an amazing community. Um, it was it was really great just to be able to t- text you, even though I knew I had Slack, but I was one of the few that you know were doing the reverse diet. Um, so like it's it's impossible to, <laughs> to fail at this. So it's just yeah. it, it's amazing just do it. You'll love it. <laughs> flies by, right? Like it's it's so just, it really does fly by yeah. when you're having fun. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Mona. I seriously appreciate you taking the time. And like, like I said, you crushed it and I want you to keep me updated. Um, you guys, her progress photos were crazy, 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 crazy. So I want to keep getting the progress updates from you and just kind of see, you know, where your journey is. And that's what I always tell people. I'm like, you want we're kind of stuck together for life like I want to be that accountability buddy for you and you know let me know if you need any questions you know have any questions along the way or need anything it's it's a partnership right like you've invested and I want to be that support for you I'm not like okay bye guys like <laughs> have a good life <laughs> so I really appreciate you thank you so much thank yeah. you to you and Cole and all the girls in the program it was yeah Thank you. Well, have a great day, Mona, and I appreciate you, and let me know if you need anything. I will. Bye.